They might be repairing. Yeah. Oh, you know what? We captured some... Captured some ships and they were they were stopped to repair. Oh, that's fine. Come at me. I'll allow it. Ten thousand men dead for the cost of two hundred. Fourteen thousand for the cost of four hundred and fifty. On a manpower, I'm making them pay for everything they've done. Tell me how this happened. Everybody declared war on me is how it happened. Austria declared war on me, then France, then Spain, then the Mamluks, and they brought in the entire planet short of China and India. But I managed to, I white-pieced out Austria. I ground, I ground them down and white-pieced out Austria. Then I managed to get a small peace deal out of out of France. I took like two provinces. So right now I'm um oh balls. Who was it? Is this guy over here? I didn't want to have to pay for another one. Eh, six fire. Um, lost the siege of Carthage. That's fine. I'm okay with rebels because my enemies are just gonna have to fight them for me. Can I get over here? I most certainly can. So ideally, um, Spain is the one I want to punish the hardest here. And, but as soon as I'm done with Spain, I'm reeling on the Mamlops. I'm going to rip them a new butthole. Recount Austria plus Britain in Kandar. True. France plus the Commonwealth and then the rest of Europe. Because um, they also had, you know, everything up here. The only thing up here that wasn't involved was Brandenburg and Scandinavia and Sweden. But all of this was against me too. Everything that was left in Europe. Um, Spain plus Portugal, yes, it was just those two. And then the Mamluks, and I don't know if they have any friends. Check their alliances. Kandar's not in that, so no, nope, they're fine. So if I siege down Lisbon, I should be able to get more war score, because it's a capital. I was like, why is there only a few thousand men there? Because the rest of them haven't shown up yet. Thank God for my vassals. Wow. These battles are starting to get really, really one-sided. Whoop. Hang on, guys. Turn around. Oh, they saw me coming and a bunch of the Portuguese were like, eh, eh. Spade's like, but I want to go home. It's going for Lisbon, but I'll do this instead. They don't have a general. They're getting slaughtered. They got a lot of troops, but they don't have a general there. We're all fine here now. Thank you. I find it amazing that after 10 years of war and millions of Romans dead, I have, I've not lost millions of, 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 of men. I have, I think, I think my total casualties have been under a million. I would say, I would definitely say they've been under a million for all the wars combined. What are we, how much more ticking war scores? Still got 13 to go. But there's nothing they can get to easily anymore. Hey, remember those Frenchies? Let's get rid of them. Oh, uh, they got some troops up here. Portugal does. They're just freezing in the Alps, though. Oh, hey, Sam. 500,000 in both the Austrian and French wars. No, it wasn't 500 apiece. I didn't lose 500,000 men in those wars. It was way less than that. It was way less than that. I think they were both around about 2 250. I have to go back and check, but I'm pretty sure they were they were around that. Oh, oh, that's cute. Oh, white piece. Oh, you think I'm gonna let you out of this? War! We're going to war! You know what? I got fifty thousand men up here. I got fifty-five thousand men in northern Italy still. I could come up here and then take you out these Spaniards, my these son. Portuguese. I demand blood and vengeance. Yeah, I demand blood and I demand the vengeance. 
You know what we'll do is we'll leave the smaller army here to siege this and we'll pull these guys out. And oh, hey, it, it, it worked. I got a, I got almost 10% war score there. Oh, come on. What the fuck? I just pieced them out of a world war. Fuck you, game. Fuck you. I just pieced them out of the biggest war that the game's ever seen. That's fucking bullshit. How long was that peace deal for? Four years? You know what? This is just gonna chain into never ending combat, is what this is gonna do. Prepare to defend yourselves! Yep, yeah, I know. I, I still think that's fucking bullshit. Well, you got stack wiped, you cocks. Where are you going? Where are you going, asshat? Well, they don't have anybody else in the war with them, so it's not that big of a deal. Did Britain declare war on him? Yeah, they did! Austria and France will- Yeah, they probably will. Austria and France will wait till those peace deals end, and then they'll immediately do it again. I, th I think that's exactly what will happen. Prussia. I'm in a war, but other than that, they would accept that. Other than that, oh, I'm never going to be able to get an ally again. <laughs> that's unfortunate. Maybe it's time to leave this war. Okay, so I want that. That and that. I can get that. I don't think I'm gonna be able to take. Oh, I can take shit over here. It's really, it's really. Well, it's not gonna let me take it over here though, because I don't. Because they have stuff siege down over here. Oh, you know what? I gotta take that one off. Can I take, like, Cuba? I can take half of Cuba. Or should not my ally am anywhere? No, because they, they separate pieced out. That's a center of trade right there. Do I want to... This is the thing is, do I want to bother with shit over here? When there's things in the Mediterranean I need to focus on? Malta? No. Maybe I could, maybe just Havana because it's a center of trade. It's one too much. Yeah, anything else is, oh wait, I could, oh, I could take shit from Portugal because reasons, because reasons. Half of Cuba is. Oh, boy. What about that? Damn it. Wow. Wait, really? Oh, you know, that's a core core. That's why. Anything else is too much, I think. I only lost 89,000 men against uh, the Spanish. They lost almost 800,000 and 560 ships. So this is a colonial war. Show superior. It's not for anything specific though. It's just show superiority. Wait, why? Where do we share? Is it because of? Is it because of this? Is it because of that? Is that okay? You gotta show your superiority over me, which means you gotta come to me, bro. Leave the colonial stuff, take the rest of Italy. No, that's way too much. I'd have to have like 100% war score to have gone that far. All right. Um, so now what we need to do, wait, we can get over to, we can get over the North Africa now. 
And I've got tons of forts in the way for them to have to get through. I could get my trade fleets back out. I captured a lot of light ships. I captured several dozen, I would say. I did not have that many, this many of light ships before. I'm gonna split this in. Nah. Let's let those let those two do their thing. Still got a positive economy. I'm gonna start wiping the floor with the Mamlux. They're already they're down three hundred thousand troops, and I basically haven't fought them yet. How long is the tree, peace, peace treaty with these guys? 94. It's over next year. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Got, a, got a fort up. There's still more places to fort. Shit. Um... If I say to fort up, we would need more, like, more dev. That's an eight. That's a nine. That's a one. Can I not, can I not pay? Oh, wait. It would, I would have to, uh, include subjects. Like, you want, you want colonies? Come get them, you fucks. Come get them. Just, uh, forts everywhere. Ah! Zurich Part 2. Oh, it'll happen. Fuck you. My, my troops are finally here. My troops are here. I'm finally able to uh, take a fight to you. You fucks. And, um, hopefully I'll be able to... What are... They're, they're, they're like out of manpower, right? Oh, I just wrecked their fleet, too. Wait. Ah, oh, god damn it. Great Britain called Kadar back into it. So this is just going to be a never-ending chain of wars. I just ended a war with these guys. Well, there's only 20-something years left of the game. Probably gonna call it a day after this. If if this is if this is the way the game's gonna play this, I'm probably just gonna end up quitting because that's not any fun. If that's the way it's gonna be. I'm just gonna end it after today. Because <laughs> that's nonsense. Oh my god. It's just chain it's just chain war you're gonna chain war me into oblivion. Uh, Bill, Bill, Brillica. Thanks for the doodle. The game hates you. Yup. Oh, that's frustrating. That's really frustrating. After all that, the hard ventures share the legends about manpower. I don't think that that's that's the thing. I don't think we've ever had manpower. So what we need to do is get down. Whoa! What the fuck's happening there? No, that was a bunch of stacks coming together at once. Uh, so let's come over and see if we can deal with this. Maybe we can... Well, I can't believe... Th I can't believe that Great Britain allied with Kandar, then called them into a war with me. That is fucking nonsense. That is nonsense. I'm hoping I can take this back quickly. Then deal with this one. After all that, it just seems like it, it doesn't really matter because the game's just going to chain me into the, into the ground. I'm bummed out. I'm really bummed out about that. Nope. Nope. Oh, it's on the other side? Oh, I was looking at this. No, wait. Is that with it? Is that with it blockaded? That is with it blockaded. Wow. Uh, well, fuck me. They got 70,000 troops here. Do they not have any can- they don't have any cannons. Oh, fuck them. They don't have any cannons. They don't have any cannons! 
Oh wait, no, they do. They have some. They don't have many, but they have some. I saw five in there. I'll go one to one with you if you didn't bring any guns to a gunfight. No, they didn't bring any guns. I rolled a three. Yeah. Oh, that poor army. That poor army. I mean, like, it's like, not, it's not that like I'm, I'm, a, I'm afeard of the British and the, uh, the Kondarians. They're not, I think I could win a war against them. It's just, it's just, it's just a bummer. Have we teched up then? Yeah. Shut the game here. Well, I'm going to finish, I probably what I'm going to do is finish the stream and we'll call it there. All right. So you guys come up this way. I'd like to stack wipe a couple of these guys while we can. There. It it, re it it really reminds me of the game I played, um, the multiplayer game I played a while back, where or half the world was just chained declaring wars on me for hundreds of years. It was just like, okay, this was funny for a little while, but now it's just frustrating. This is a fine line, guys. There's not enough men there. I guess we'll switch then. Well, they're not taking um Sfax anytime soon. And we clear we cleared out the doodle there, so I guess we'll just continue the siege. Fighting the Mamluks is easy, yeah. Is that the word where Bob abused you? Yeah, that was it. Arrived just in time, spent how all my day purging social media. Well, the easiest way to do that is just to delete all your accounts. And there's the peace treaty with Austria. And unfortunately, because I'm at war, I can't get any new allies, which means the next set of wars, I won't have Russia on my side. Here are these guys rebels for them. I'm just building more forts and hoping for the best. Well, I mean, most of the forts I was building are over here. Yeah, die in the jungles of Roman Brazil. So they just they just went around and they're going they're going they're they're, they're going to the back door. Let's see if we can get this. Oh, that's frustrating. I was really looking forward to having like a good end of the game. Eat a bag of dicks. Eat a bag of dicks. They got Eat a bag of dicks. Uh, a class of history of never-ending wars with Rome. Yep, it's a good. It's a good, good class. Well, they got. They got some. Some galleys here, so it's actually a fight. But they just left before anybody really got hurt, so not a big deal in the end. It'd be nice to actually have some manpower. Yep, there it is. Yep. That's what the end of the game is just gonna be. That is more than frustrating is what that is. Coalition after coalition. These are not coalitions. These are just, these are just, I've never, I have this, I've not had coalition in this. I might, uh, with, with, with this, I don't know. I don't, I don't know if I'm, I don't know if I feel up for another countless, endless war. I right, gotta do EU4 with Lady Mags, yeah. No, nope, this is just gonna be chain wars, chain pointless wars forever now. With 25 years left in the game. It's a very frustrating way to end.
What I don't what I don't get is why did all of a sudden eat a bag of everybody in the war makes ma or pointless words. Everybody in the world, everybody, the whole planet decided to attack me all at once. It's like something in the code was just like on this exact time, things go tits up. And I haven't even seen well who's Austria is gonna bring into this this time. Allied with Great Britain and Kandar, so they can't bring anybody else in. Junior partner of the Platinet. That's frustrating. Well, let's see. Let's see if we can hold out for a little longer before just throwing in the towel. Oh yeah, now we've got Kandar's hundred thousand men in North Africa. Which means North Africa needs to be abandoned. No, oh, use the ships. Yeah, I don't. There's no. There's no infantry left. Yeah, th this army literally doesn't have any infantry in it. Same thing happened to me too. Yeah, I'll finish. See you as revolutionary power. I'm not a revolutionary power. I didn't go revolutionary. See, this this is this is something I've always thought was a little bit wrong in EU4 is that the peace deals are not long in, in some cases are not long enough. They're not long enough because, like like some of the I think some of the ones with the guys I pieced out were something like four years long, four to five I think. And it wasn't even enough time to end the war before they just chained in more ones. This is it the aggressive AI behavior that's been introduced some patches ago? The AI is now much more likely to deal or something uh, they deem weakened by a war that's already going on. They're short if it's a white piece. You, well, yeah, yeah, I know that. That's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying is the is the issue here is that they can just do that, and that's what leads to these disastrous chain oblivions. This is not the first time where I've had games end where it was just like the entire world all at once decided they were just going to fuck you. It's yeah, this is purely pointless. Yeah, I'm thinking of just calling it here because it's not. I, I after all of that, after having pulled it out. After all of that, it's just, it's just annoying and pointless. Because we won, we won against Austria and all their allies. We won against France and all their allies. We won against Spain and all Spain's allies. And we were just sweeping down through the Mamluks. And then Great Britain declared war. And they brought in Kandar, and then Austria, and you got. Well, hang on, hang on. Let's look. Let's check something. I only got two more years, less than two years. I got less than two years until um, the peace treaty with France ends, and um, and then they'll join. They'll probably join back in. I can pretty much guarantee you the Commonwealth would join in with them as well. Who is now allied with Spain? The the um the thing that I found curious was right at the beginning, the beginning of this whole the, the beginning of this snowball is was Austria declaring war on me, and Russia joined in on that war, and it was just I think it was Austria and Kandar maybe. How many wars are we still in? Three. Well, I got it down to one, and then they all just started declaring war on me again. Um, Austria declaring war on me, that was a no-win scenario for them. They could not have won that war if it was if, if everybody else hadn't dogpiled in. Because me and Russia, I alone probably could have beaten Austria. But me and Russia against Austria, fuck that. They were they would have been screwed. Oh, what time is it? Half, half, half in here. Mm, that sucks. 
because I don't, I really don't feel like continuing because I, you know, you, you and me both know exactly how this is going to end up. Eat a bag of dicks. Time for more hits. Thanks, Gibbs. You and you, you and me both know uh, exactly how this is going to end up. In two years, France and the Commonwealth are going to declare war on me, and that I've got only four years until Spain declares war on me. No, wait. Uh, no, it's 1801 here, so, so seven years until this one. Don't need to see the rest of this. It's not safe for work. I think I'm, I'm trying to think of anything, something else I could do. I think we should just, I think we should just call it early today. Unfortunately, because I, as much as I want to start a new one up, I want to start a new one. Enjoy the game. Sorry, I it was frustration. Yeah, two dog. Thanks very much, by the way. It is speed five to the end. Um, hang on. I know, so I know what we could do. I'm, I am going to call it a victory. Call it a victory with, um, with me ending three of those four wars on the positive. And I would have been able to take on the Mablocks. And I would have been able to take on Great Britain. And I would have been taken able to take on Kandara again. But but Austria dogpiling back into it, and you know France is coming back in too. Uh Leah, no, I don't think so. I don't feel like starting up something new that we're not going to do for that long. Um I think I think we'll just call it a day here. I think that's for the best so that we can start fresh next week. <laughs>